obesity is reaching epidemic proportions around the world. It's becoming a problem for life insurers because it can lead to a host of other health-related problems. Obesity is determined by the amount of body fat a person has relative to their muscle, bone, and organs. Your body mass is based on a mathematical calculation that's based on your height and weight and compared to a standardized body mass index or BMI chart. Now the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention lists an overweight adult as having a BMI between 25 and 29.9. An obese adult has a BMI of 30 or higher. So how does obesity affect insurance premiums? If a 55-year-old male non-smoker with a BMI of, say, 38 wants to get a $250,000 life insurance policy, he would pay an annual premium of about $4,200. But if a 55-year-old male non-smoker with a BMI of, say, 30 wants to get a $250,000 life insurance policy, he would pay an annual premium of about $3,700. Now keep in mind, while these are just estimates, the fact remains that the higher your BMI, the harder you'll feel it in your wallet, and not just for life insurance. You'll also pay more for health problems down the line. Now to get low-cost life insurance and avoid these high medical bills, experts recommend you lose weight, exercise, and eat a healthy diet. Folks who are underweight, well, guess what? They can also be charged higher rates for insurance. If you'd like to know your BMI, check out the National Heart, Lung, and Blood Institute's free BMI calculator. Thanks for watching.